causes of chronic dizziness after a unilateral inner ear injury. Examples would be vestibular neuritis. Going forward, I will refer to this as unilateral vestibulopathy. So how do we know who will get better and who will not? Researchers in essence found that those who have greater visual dependence, also those who have worse static balance, and those who have more anxiety are more likely to have residual dizziness after having an inner ear injury. Many people go through physical therapy after acute unilateral vestibulopathies. And if you are still suffering with acute unilateral vestibulopathy dizziness, such as after vestibular neuritis, check out my other videos on these topics, such as triple PD and vestibular neuritis. Let me know your thoughts. Dr. Randall Gates, board certified chiropractic neurologist, chiropractic physician from Gates Brain Health and Advanced Imaging Reno.